look, if they want a radio in the room, it's 25 cents a day for everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Did you get Soderquist? Upstairs. Cronin picked up his stuff. What about the nun? She got lucky. Well, I'm glad she did. You're piling up too many mistakes, Joe. Killing Gruber was a mistake. It happened. Anybody ever tell you about murder? It's against the law. You didn't cry too hard at the time. It was a mistake anyway. Now this thing about the nun, forget about it. We may never hear from her again. Soderquist will. There's a police call out for him. Are you sure she can identify him? How about you? I don't think so. But he could identify me. It's too much of a chance. We've got to get him out of here. And then we'll worry about that nun, in case she did see me. You'll forget about the nun, Joe. I'm still running things. Remember that. If they ever get me in the back room of that police station, I'll have it on the tip of my tongue. Ah, good afternoon, Miss Nagel. Good afternoon, Mr. Vester. We'll have that quarter room for you in a day or two. Thank you. Nice Hello, fellas. Hi. Sit down. How about a cup of coffee? No, thanks, George. I fixed the room up pretty good, huh? George. You want a cookie? George, you've got to get out of here. You've been identified by the nun. You don't know for sure. We can't afford to take a chance. You better go to St. Louis for a while. S St. Louis? I don't even know anybody in St. Louis. You're not going there to run for office. You're going to protect yourself and us. Don't, Joe. I don't know about going to St. Louis. Give him the picture, George. It's my son. Did you ever see a picture of him, Morrow? Yep. You know, it was terrible how his mother took him away. She just up and left one night, and I... I didn't see him since. But I still had a picture. And the baby shoes, the way they fix them up with bronze for a keepsake. Let's talk about it some other time, huh, George? Yeah. You know what's funny about kids, Earl? They change all the time. Yeah, I know. Let's start packing. I'm not going, Earl. I told you I don't want to go. You know what's coming up. May not even work out. If it does, you'll be taken care of. How do I know? Because I promise you. No, Earl. That's the most m money I ever heard of. If I'm dealt out, I'm dealt out, and I don't have a prayer. You won't pack this stuff, I will. Stay away from that suitcase. I'm not going, whatever you fellas say. Joe, what I ever do to you, Joe? Well, what else could we do? As one hero to another, what else? <laughs> 